I grew up right here, uh, right up the street from the farm. When I was a kid, this was my playground. I had my first garden probably in, when I was in fifth grade. Yeah, it wasn't a big garden, but I was curious and I wanted to see stuff grow. I've probably been farming and gardening in some fashion for most of my life. You know, you get the seed catalogs and everything looks so great that anybody can do it, right? <laughs> I fell for it. I've got family members that are indispensable, and Bob basically takes care of helping me get up and running in the beginning of the season. George, you know, tends to the bees here. Longview Flower is definitely not a one-man operation. I, I go to, I do a market in Headhouse Square, and I do a market in Princeton. At these farmers markets, a lot of my customers are very interested about where I'm growing and they wanted to see the farm and they would love to, you know, it must be beautiful there and all that. quite a pleasant place to be after the sun goes behind the trees. It's, it's kind of magical. I just want to do what I love. I, I've loved everything I've done so far. 